ATMs are everywhere, from street corners to stores and restaurants. But are they really safe to use? Every year, more than 3 million Americans are victimized by ATM fraud, and the numbers keep going up. The team is about to show you just how little you know. When people use an ATM, they don't really pay close attention. As long as the machine works and they get their cash, they think everything is cool. But this hustle is going to show you what happens when you don't pay close attention. This is the Cash Machine Con. The hustler's target? An ATM machine outside of a cafe. Phase 1. Apollo's job is to attach an electronic card reader equipped with a tiny camera to the ATM slot without getting caught. Here it is before, and here it is after. Would you think twice about using this machine? Phase 2. All he has to do now is sit and wait for a mark. A woman approaches. She takes out her wallet. She's at the ATM. Will she spot the fake card reader? She doesn't even hesitate. The hustler's device picks up all of the data from her card's magnetic strip. And the miniature video camera captures her entering her pin. Within 30 seconds, all the Mark's card details have been recorded. Phase 3. Apollo retrieves the device and heads to the hustler's truck. Hey guys. How'd it go? It was fast. Yeah, great. There you go. Great. I'm just going to connect it to the computer and then I can download the video. The info stored on the card reader is downloaded onto their computer as well as the video of the PIN number. They now have all they need to make a new ATM card and completely empty the Mark's bank account. All right, there you go. Ryan clones the information from the woman's ATM card onto a hotel room key and Apollo tests it out. It's as simple as that. Were you just using the ATM machine? Yeah. I think you left some of your information here. Time to reveal to this woman what happened. Do you notice anything different about the machine than a while ago? No. No? Turn around for a second. Look at this. This piece was here a while ago. Does that look a little bit different than it did? Yeah. That's not part of the machine. You just ran your card through this device, and that was reading all your card information. And then this needle right here, the needle hole, was shooting at your PIN numbers when you punched in. So now we have your PIN number and your credit card information. You all right? The mark is stunned. That really freaks me out because it just makes you realize how easy it is for people to just take your information and uh, you wouldn't even know. Because there's a lot of things that you just don't pay attention to, things that you do every day, and you think it's just an ATM machine. Yeah, it is kind of scary. Now we're going to up the game a little. We're going to show you how a resourceful hustler doesn't have to use high-tech devices. They just need nerves of steel. This second hit uses clever choreography and split-second timing. Phase 1. Apollo is in position close to the ATM. He will play a vital role a little later. Cue Danny, who's pretending to be injured. Danny starts to use the machine, but she's really waiting for someone to get in line behind her. This woman is now the mark. And her every move is being watched by Apollo. She takes out her bank card. Time for phase two. This was a critical moment. I only had a split second to match her card with the ones in my collection. Got it. Now for phase three. Danny is about to cause a distraction, giving Apollo the opportunity to swap his bogus card for the marks. Get out of your way. <laughs> oh. 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 
Danny falls over just as the mark dips her card. The woman looks over towards the distraction, but leaves her card hanging in midair. And because she's already dipped it, she's ready to enter her pin and put her card away. Time to strike. Apollo goes to help Danny, switching the card on the way. But will the mark spot the switched bank card? I get some she doesn't even look. When I bumped into her, she didn't notice that I took the card out of her hand and dropped another one in its place, because she was too distracted by Danny. Now, as the mark enters her pin, Apollo shoulder surfs, and the hustlers once again have everything they need to empty someone's bank account. She's been hustled. So, how does she feel? I felt violated, to be honest with you. I felt as if, how could I be so silly and keep my card out while trying to help someone in distress, not realizing, oh my goodness, you weren't paying attention. On the black market, two bank cards with PIN numbers could fetch a cool $20,000.